everyone so long time no see it's been forever I went to India for Christmas and then I came back and I've got a million and one deadlines but I've got a little bit of time today so I thought I'd um, make my entrance again make my appearance again so this is a tutorial and um, I haven't done one in quite a while so please bear with me if I sound a little bit uncomfortable talking to myself again um, you have to kind of get used to it when you've left it for a little while but I'm back now and I will be putting up more tutorials more videos as um, as much as I can um, the other thing is that um, I just want to make people aware that I am more sort of updating my blog a little bit more regularly than I actually used to so please go ahead and um, add me and follow me on my blog I'll put the link to that in the info box and I will also put all the products and all the pictures for this look um, on my blog in a blog post as well so without further ado I'm gonna tell you how you can get this look and I really hope you guys enjoy it I'll see you all in the next video very soon bye Okay, so as usual, the first thing to do would be to prime your eyelid, and I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Primer Potion. I'm back to this. Um, I found that the Too Faced Shadow Insurance was getting a little bit too oily for my eyelid. So, as I said, I'm back to using the Urban Decay Primer Potion. So you just want to get that all over your eyelid, right up to your brow bone. Make sure you get it into the inner corner as well. Okay, so next I'm going to take just a little bit of the MAC Paint Pot in Indian Wood and I'm just going to take a very, very tiny amount of this on my finger and just sort of pat that just onto the base of the eyelid. Just next, my... I'm going to take this colour here and this is um, Wild by Nature and this is from the Leopard Lux Eye uh, Quad from the Fabulous Felines collection and I'm going to take that on the MAC 239 brush and I'm going to pat that um, just wherever I put the Indian Wood paint pot just to lighten that up a very very tiny amount I'm going to take rice paper And I'm just going to tap that lightly on top of where I put Wild by Nature. And you can see that that lightens up that colour just a very, very small. Okay, next I'm going to take Handwritten. This is like a chocolate brown colour. Um, Twice Baked by Urban Decay will do as well. And I'm going to use this on the MAC, I think it's 227 or 217 maybe. It's the fluffy brush and I'm just going to apply this very very lightly into the outer corner of my eyelid and this is going to give you the very tiny amount of depth that you want to this look okay next taking wedge which is a sort of taupey brown colour um, and that same 217 fluffy brush we're going to use that to sort of blend out the handwritten. So you can use that to sort of bring it in further into the crease and further up toward the brow bone. Alright, so now I'm going to actually upper, um, line my upper lash line with the MAC Fluid Line in Dip Down, which is just a brown gel eyeliner. And you can use any... Um, brown eyeliner, any brown eyeliner will work for this look. Okay, and I'm going to line my upper lash line very, very finely, and I'm not going to wing it out at the outer corner. Okay, and you can leave it like that if you like it really natural, just sort of add a little bit of mascara and you're done. But I'm going to take it a little bit further and I'm actually going to add a black um, colour to the lid. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a black eyeliner and this is the Urban Decay 01. And I'm just going 
to um, just draw that on in the outer corner just over where we applied the dip down and then with a fluffy pencil brush like this one and carbon by MAC or any other um, sort of matte black eyeshadow okay I'm just gonna hold the corner of my eye and just kind of smudge that black eyeshadow into the outer V of my For eyelid. highlight I'm gonna take rice paper again with the Inglot 28 PO brush which is a nice sort of large pad brush and I'm just very gently going to tap that underneath the arch of my eyebrow. Okay, so now I'm just going to curl my lashes and apply my mascara and I'll be right Finally, back. I forgot one step. Um, I'm just going to take a cotton bud and clean off any liquid along my waterline. And then I'm going to take the Urban Decay eye pencil in Whiskey and this came with the Naked palette and I'm just going to line my lower waterline. You don't have to use this one at all, this brown eyeliner, you can use any brown eyeliner. Okay wish. so this is the final look. For cheeks I used um, the MAC Mineralize Finish in Comfort and I've had this forever and I use it all the time. I absolutely love it. Um, and then on the cheeks of my um, on the apples of my cheeks, sorry, I used the e.l.f. blush in Plum, which actually comes out quite pink, so um, it's quite a nice colour to use on the apples of your cheeks when you want to look a little bit blushed. And then on my lips, I used the MAC Viv uh, Viva Glam Cindy. So this is the Cindy Lorp one, which I really, really like, and I haven't actually used it that much since I got it. Um, but yeah, that is everything that I used. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Please visit my blog for a list of all the products and pictures. And I'll see you all very soon in the next tutorial. Bye.